Jerry. So this is Jerry, and Jerry is a regular client of ours. He's a big boy, got beautiful markings, he really is, and he's a right little character, aren't you? He's known as Jerry the Berry, isn't Jerry he? the Berry he's known as. Yeah. And if anybody knows the name Jerry the Berry, that came from... Phoenix Nights. Phoenix Nights, which was a big hit here in the UK. Uh, <laughs> yes! So he's come in this morning for his regular, just, just a check over. And a good groom, bit of a papa really, Jerry, isn't it, hey? Just to keep on top of him, he's got such a thick coat, he does tend to get all matted down his back. Again, he's a little on the large side and he, he's a very lazy groomer, but he also struggles to reach a bit. And, of course, he starts to get clumped down his back and he's not too bad this time round at all. Just feeling, they're just starting on these hind legs, aren't they, Jerry? Hey? So, and, and his coat feels a little bit, I don't know what the word is, a bit clammy almost. So we're going to have a good thin out, sort him out, and uh, we're going to get started. He's just come out of the basket, and he's been meowing the whole way here. From Liverpool, isn't he's he? He's from Liverpool, he's come through the tunnel, come to see us. Yes. And you know, look at him now, quiet as a mouse. <laughs> Hey, you good boy? Yeah, you're a good boy. I'm just going to get started on these claws. Oh, he's a good boy. So I don't want your whiskers in my way, thank you. There you go. Good boy. Good lad. Quite long, Jerry. Good boy. How good is he? Yeah. There you go, little Dudsy. No, it's his auntie, Nita. He does, yes. <laughs> You're a good lad, aren't you? Hey. Can we do this front one here as well? Hmm. Can we get this one? Oh, there he is. What a good Look at that. Oh, he says, what have I seen out there? So he's looking out our windows. Our window backs onto a field. So he's having a good look out at the field. He says, that's good hunting ground. <laughs> right, that's the front two. So I'm going to do the front, the back two. I'm just going to start on his head here just to settle him. Yes. So the comb's not quite going through him. Because as I sort of said, his coat's just a little bit like clammy. Like so that's the wrong word, but it's the comb sticking in him. It's just because he's so thick. He's a good boy. Oh he says. That looks very interesting out that way. Hey? Yeah, good boy, then, Jerry. His dad Warren loves Jerry, doesn't he? Oh, he's, yeah. yeah. His dad dopes on you, doesn't he? Yeah. Hey? He does. Got a lovely garden in Liverpool, haven't you, mate? Hey, you good boy. Hey, you're a good boy. You are. Yeah, he's just dead hair. Yeah. Just stuck in his coat. And that's from a short hair, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So it's just. Hey, you Jimmy. It's just doing really good to have that. And look at that comb now, that's just sort of going through nicely there now. It was getting jammed before. Yeah, it's amazing what you can get off, isn't it? Yeah, because to the eye, it doesn't look like there's anything wrong with him. But when you put the comb in, you can, you can feel it. So that is going through beautifully now. Isn't it? And you're such a good boy. 
<laughs> Sitting there all handsome, getting pampered, aren't you? Mm. Yeah. Now, can you go in here properly? Can't see what I'm doing on that side. It's too, too tall for me sitting. Like that. Good boy. <laughs> you rubby dubbing. Oh, you rubby dubbing. You are. I haven't seen you for a while, has we? we haven't seen him for a while, no. Tell me the baby. Good boy. Hey. All strange. Isn't it? Hey. Yeah. Good boy. Should we catch up with him later, Nate? We can do. He's mm. just so lovely, isn't he? <laughs> yeah. This is the problem. <laughs> when you're a cat groomer, and you've got a pussy cat that just loves attention and loves fusses. It's hard, isn't it, to keep just grooming? <laughs> hey? It is, because you just want some attention. You do. No, you know, Joey. I know. You're a good boy. You are a good boy. So I'm going to just carry on working down this coat. Because he's got this all over him. So there'll be quite a mound to come away from him, I expect. Yes, you keep looking at me. You're saying thank you. Oops, he's Auntie Nita, wasn't he? It's better than going to the vet. I think he thought he was going to the vet in his carrier. Didn't you? Catch you later. So this is normally the worst place for most cats is the sort of the flanks, the back end area. And you can see Jerry's no different. A very, very thick coat. And if this was left another few weeks, these would be quite bad. Um, turning into solid pelts so we've caught him just at the right time to be able to get the comb in here you agreeing Jerry? because sometimes when we've been to him in the past we have had to clip him and he's had little patches where we've had to put the clippers into his coat but today that's not going to happen because we can get the comb through all of this we can Jerry So you wouldn't believe, just looking at him, the coat looks, you know, to the eye, looks fine. So when you start to put the comb in, you realise quite how thick and all this old hair is sitting in this coat. What comb is that? A molting comb? This is my molting comb. Yeah. Molting comb on every cat's body. It's the two teeth. All the links to all my products are in the descriptions below each video I do to make it easy for you. And also, if you like watching these videos and you want more, or if there's anything you'd like to see in particular, or you want to ask me any questions, please do so. Leave them on the channel. And also, like, share and subscribe. And it will help the channel and it will help me reach far more people and spread the knowledge of how important it is to groom our cats. Because I say it all the time, don't I? A lot of people think that cats can just look after themselves and they don't need any help from us. And that's just not true. We have to help them. 
and also it builds up a lovely bond between you and your cat when you do the grooming. Yes! Oh, Jerry. Exactly, Jerry. Oh, good boy. Are you agreeing? Hey. Yeah. So all I'm doing at the moment, I'm going through the whole coat with the molten comb. And then I'm going to put some dry foam shampoo onto Jerry. And go through the coat again with the comb. That's just off that bit, isn't it? That's just this flank, yeah. yeah. That, that from That's the already side. off. Yeah. <laughs> You're very chatty today, mate. You were quiet before. You're very chatty. Found your voice now. Hey. You found your voice now, have you? Yes. He always a good boy. <laughs> he says, I'll have a lot of that, please. Tickle under the chin. Okay. So let's just move across here a little bit. So what I'll do, I'll carry on going through all this with the comb. And then we'll come back when we put the shampoo onto him and let you see what we do with the shampoo, the foam shampoo. So look at this relaxed, <laughs> this relaxed boy. You're gorgeous, aren't you? Loves the groom. So he's had a good groom through there, and I'm literally going to put some dry foam shampoo onto him now. Good boy. Mm, he's used to this, aren't you, Jerry? Literally, this goes all into the coat. Yes, good boy. And then we just carry on with the groom through. <laughs> you are a good boy. Let's get some of that out there. Hey, aren't you? You're a star pupil, you are. Jerry, aren't you? Just lying here, relaxing. Hey. Good boy. So I'm just getting that shampoo all through the coat. Yeah. Good boy. And then what I'll do, I'll just do another little sort of groom through. <laughs> oh, Jerry, you're a one, aren't you? You're a one. So of course, when he first arrived, we couldn't get the comb through that coat easily. It's going through lovely now. And he feels lovely to the touch. Don't you? Hey, feel lovely. So we're still getting bits out of this. It is going through very nicely now. I've got all that off a short hair. Yeah, all that dead hair. Yeah. So he's still giving me a little bit, look. <laughs> still giving me bits there. Good lad, you're going to turn him round. You always do this, don't you? Come for cooks. You come for a cuddle. Hey. Oh, yeah. Oh, Jerry. He's gorgeous. Isn't he? Jerry's gorgeous. Yeah. Let's just get in here. Let's get to this side. <laughs> 
Here's a good boy. Let's just check all this sides okay. Right. Yeah, oh I know. Oh, no, no, Jerry. I know. No. You good boy. Yeah. I think he's missed you. Yeah, have you? Oh, what's that here? Oh, <laughs> good lad. You've been a good boy, you have. Oh, he does like his fusses, don't he? He does like his fusses. Jerry. What a face. What a face. He's actually much quieter on the table here than he is at home, isn't he? When we grew him at home. At home, he's a little bit of a fidget. Chirping. Look at you here. Quite relaxed, aren't you? Have his belly tickled in a minute. What's that? Having your belly tickled. Hey. Well, I need to do your tummy in a bit. I haven't looked at this bit yet, have we? Well, we've got you there nicely. Oh. Hey. What a tart. Hey. Lovely. Good boy. Very good boy. What a good boy. Let's have this leggy. Good boy. So again, we just lift the leg. Okay, baby. Shh, 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 shh. Lift the leg to get to the tummy, don't we? <laughs> you know, you're really pearly for me then. Where are you? So there is nothing under this tummy. Good boy. Mister? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> good boy. What a good lad. So, let's just get some spray over the top of you. Okay. In a minute, we'll get the zoom groom onto him. because I know you like this. Yes. And this will now just bring his oils through. I know, Jerry, you love it, don't you? Yeah. It'd be best from the front here, Steve, where you see his face. <laughs> oh, Jerry. You're a good boy, aren't you? Hey. Oh, he likes a zoom guru. Oh, yeah, over the shoulders, definitely. Mm. Well, he loves this anywhere, but the shoulders. Mm. Number one. Enjoying that song. Yeah. Wow. Oh, nice and relaxing for the cat. Good for the blood circulation and great for bringing the natural oils through the coat, which helps them feel beautiful. Again, link underneath in the description for the Zoom Groom. It's just like a, a rubbery style, flexible brush. And it grabs the hair that the comb misses, the very fine, you can see all this very fine stuff here, all the wispies that the comb misses, the Zoom Grooms managed to get. I know. On the 
heb je longest videos niet. Is it? I think so. <laughs> 20 minutes. Now. God, he's a little star. <laughs> oh, aren't you? Yay. Yeah. Oh, Jerry. Good boy. So now I've got to just check his eyes and his ears as the next task. Yeah. And your hind claws. We well, did your front ones before, didn't we? We'll do your back ones in a minute. Just that normally I do all four claws right off the start, which helps. Uh, oh, headbutt. <laughs> headbutt. Uh, just helps protect me if the cat does try to scratch or kick out with those hind feet. But I know Jerry, um, you know, I know how well behaved a boy he is. Oh, look at that. Mm. Yes. We'll just flop. We'll just flop on that table. Your dad will be amazed when he sees you like this. Is you normally a fidget? You are. Let me finish on that bit. Yeah. So, like I said, I'm just going to finish with his eyes and his ears and his back claws, and he's going to be all done and ready to go home. Jerry. It's the gorgeous Jerry the Berry. Back to the pool. Yeah. See you, baby. Good boy.